Okay. Okay. Hi. My name is Tam. Welcome to this video. I'm doing another Pete and Bass reaction. Pete and Boss. Boss. <laughs> Pete and Boss. Sorry, I got a little intense there. My apologies. But I'm doing another reaction. Uh, this one should be, if I remember correctly, this is a long thorn shotgun. So I'm looking forward to it. And without further ado, let's get into it. I kind of need to shave and cut my hair. This is not a good look, huh? Why I got step out, dripping in black leather. Eat, stay tuck, never mind cold weather. Bang whenever, your soul get peppered. So I get turned black and white like checkers. Blacks and whites in the batch in his two tone suits and the boys black belts like judo. Get slapped down flat, no uno. Feds out guessing who done it just like Cluedo. Shotgun pressed on the chest for the kickback. Check shit, get boxed up like a tic tac. I feel the fella up with a big mac. Lick shots, belly get split like six pack. I started, I, I felt like, I felt my entire intelligence, I felt my mind struggle to understand that ball. Not because it's dumb, but because I just didn't get it. Leg shots barely get split like six pack. Are you talking about like a six pack of beer? But six packs of beer are meant to be split. So I guess he's talking about six pack here because they don't get split. Yo, yo, I can see people just getting mad at me in the comments like, I don't understand a damn thing. <laughs> now we got to explain the whole video to you. <laughs> like, like, it was that one section. Like, the rest of the stuff I get. <laughs> Zach, guessing who done it just like Cluedo. Shotgun pressed on the chest for the kickback. Chat shit, get boxed up like a tic tac. I fill the fella up with a big mac. Lick shots, belly get split like six pack. Last lane chicks in the back on the bubble with a shard night. Yeah. I made it through the dark days, Phantom. Looking at the roof, you can start guys. See, 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 see. What the hell is on my lap? Oh, okay, I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> that one I can get, you know. Phantom looking at the roof, you can start gaze. Because the Rolls Royce Phantoms, or I guess Rolls Royce vehicles in general, especially now, come with stars in the roof no you know what i mean not literal stars but they're like lights it's handcrafted stuff and it's all in there so that's what he means you can stargaze oh okay 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 i can already see you yeah okay okay this i made it through the dark days phantom look this is this is dope Looking at the roof, you can start guys. Bright lights, picking up the watch because he's diamond. Tick tock, cocking with impeccable timing. Mm. Hopping the whip with the first sight of sirens. Back to the pub, fun sob with a liming. Fill another cup, yeah, let me sink that. Own run, knock him out of the park when I swing bats. <laughs> Split him in the middle like a Kit Kat. Split throw, drink, poor Lord, can I kick back? Kick back doesn't work well with a work ethic. I've been through the dirt and I learned lessons. Went from a dinger with a dents in there. Got vents in the bonnet in his burlesque. I really like I really like Bass. I would even like every time, every time he hops on a track, I find his flow so interesting. I find the words he uses so nice. <laughs> Just like listening to him. I like listening to him rap. Mm. Same with Pete. But even when like <clears throat> it's, it's 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 an issue I have with I rap as well. Uh, even when I'm trying to chill, like literally, he's he asked to chill. So, uh, Lord, can I kick back, drink port, like spliff roll, things like that? <laughs> because of his voice when he raps, it sounds like he's just getting at you. <laughs> It just sounds like he's getting at someone, or it just sounds rough, it sounds rough. But that's not the case, he literally just went, Lord, can I kick back? 
from a dinger with a dents in there Got vents in the bonnet and it's burlesque Skirt in the dark like a wicking Right for the picking, fried like a chicken He could have been alive but he's kicking The bucket, down to the bone finger licking right. Guys, I don't wanna He could have been alive but he kicking The bucket, down to the bone finger licking He could have been alive Case dead so I understand that first one. Actually, why am I breaking it down like I'm a dumbass? No, no, no. Let me not pretend I'm a dumbass. He could have been alive, but he kicking the bucket. Cool. Down to the bone finger licking. That's the part that confused me because the only thing I'm thinking about is that the bucket line is linked to the down to the bone, meaning they burnt this man's body in some acid down to the bone. And obviously... He said finger licking because KFC, you eat it down to the bone. And KFC's slogan is it's finger licking good, I think. I'm joking, my fat ass knows. <laughs> In the dark like a wicked, right for the picking, fried like a chicken. He could have been alive, but he's kicking the bucket, down to the bone, finger licking. Oh, the buck, the KFC bucket. Not a bucket burning acid. Okay. <laughs> it took me so long. It took me so long to click. Okay, okay. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. How, how, how do they say it in the UK? I didn't deep it. I didn't deep it. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't, I didn't like get it. I didn't get it. Okay, okay. He meant KFC bucket. He didn't mean bucket burning acid guy. Damn, okay, now uh, I think I'm gonna run it back a little more just to see if there's anything else I missed. <laughs> I'm hiding through the dark dice phantom, looking at the roof, you can start guys. Bright lights, picking up the watch because he's diamond. Tick tock, talking with impeccable timing. Hopping the whip in the first sight of sirens. Back to the pub, what's sub with alignment. Fill another cup, yeah, let me sink that. Own run, knock him out of the park when I swing bats. Split him in the middle like a kick cat. Split throw, drink, poor lord, can I kick back? Kick back doesn't work well with the work ethic. Kickback doesn't work well with the work ethic. See, that one, that one's pretty straightforward. I didn't miss anything there. That's why I didn't react to it. But also, I just really like that line. I really like that line that to the concept of relaxing doesn't it doesn't meld well with the amount of work I put in and the amount of work I put out. Just doesn't make sense. And I learned lessons Went from a dinger with a dents in there Got vents in the bonnet and it's burlesque Skirt in the dark like a wicking Right for the picking Fried like a chicken He could have been alive but he's kicking The bucket Ah uh, So it, that, that the, the KFC line started from the beginning Fried like a chicken Ah uh, Yeah Yeah <laughs> Yeah Down to the bone finger licking Right in the place that thing is plaguing my mind, honestly. Like, uh, cause it's a, it's a Gunner song. It's that uh, Fukumin, and it is plaguing my mind. That, yeah. But I heard it once. I heard it a second time, cause it is quite a fun song. And it is quite a fun sound. Yeah. Wouldn't play it a third time, cause I realized how much I would get sick of it. And just hearing that noise over and over again for because I think that song is like two minutes 40 seconds. So let's round it up to three. For another three minutes, I couldn't do it. Could have been alive, but he's kicking the bucket down to the bone finger licking. Right in the place on the face of a chunk, then I'm breaking his bread, then I'm taking a chunk. I ain't never leave a trace because I did him up free and gloves on, they ain't getting prints off of these hands. Bread, then I'm taking a chunk. I ain't in the bucket, down to the bone finger licking. Right in the place on the face of a chunk, then I'm breaking his bread, then I'm taking a chunk. I ain't never leave a trace because I think. See, okay, okay, so. Breaking, break dinner plates on the face of a chunk, then I'm breaking his bread and I'm taking a chunk. So, what I'm assuming is. <clears throat> so, since this is a antagonistic altercation, it is an altercation where it turns violent. This isn't 
break bread in terms of peace. So, <laughs> he may just be talking about, like, break dinner plates on the face of a champ. Very easy to understand. Uh, then I'm breaking his bread and I'm taking a chunk. So, I assume he's saying, all that money is gone. I'm going to take it. Take a giant piece. A chunk. A chunk is not a small bit. A chunk is not a small bit. A chunk is a big bit. So, he takes a chunk. Gets out of there. I feel like people are going to watch this video and go, what the hell is going on with him? <laughs> but it's fine. So he's he's so unserious, but he's actually explaining the lyrics. <laughs> Breaking his bread and I'm taking a chunk. I ain't never leave a trace because I did him up free. I ain't gloves on. They ain't get... <laughs> oh, that's nice. I never leave a trace because I did him up free. And I never leave a trace. Cause I did him up free hand. Okay. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. That's nice. <laughs> okay, now I sound old. <laughs> I'm delving more and more into these my cartoon cartoonish voices. I don't know why. I think it's because I've been spending so much time alone, so I need someone to talk to. So I make them. Nothing's wrong with that. Breaking a plates on the face of a chunk, then I'm breaking his bread, then I'm taking a chunk. I ain't never leave a trace, cause I did them up free and gloves on, they ain't getting prints over these hands. Me and fetch in a plow, the words got thicker, then the belly got fatter. When the feds come knocking at the door, I ain't never leave a trace, cause I did them up free and gloves on, they ain't getting prints over these hands. I don't know if you guys can notice. Every time I feel like I'm missing a lyric, I run it back and I get closer. Read them. Read them. Just in case that, like, there's something in the cracks of the subtitles. <laughs> Me and fetch in a plow. The words got thicker than the belly got fatter. When the feds come knocking at the door for the same old, I'ma just knock him out flat, no chatter. Double chuffing the blunt, chugging the Bombay, John Wayne Gate. When I'm stepping on the runway, six shot cut down. When he for the gunplay, pray. John Wayne Gate, when I'm, when I'm. John Wayne Gate when I step on the runway. Hold up. I'ma just knock him out flat, no chatter. Double chuffing the blunt, chugging the bomb by John Wayne Gate when I'm stepping on the runway. Six. So John Wayne Gate when I'm stepping on the runway. Just in case some people don't know what a gate is. <laughs> there were people who heard me heard that section and immediately got offended. But no, uh, a gate as in. Uh, how can I say a gate in the sense that he's using the word is a manner of walking so he's saying he's walking like John Wayne when he's stepping on the runway bitch <laughs> dude also I just wanted to throw this in do you know how fun that word is to add at the end of stuff just random stuff just and I, I, I do it by myself because I'm not going to do it with my friends because once you know I offend my friends I'm going to do it with strangers strangers might pep me up <clears throat> not doing that oh, let's get back to the song double chuffing the blunt chugging the bomb by John Wayne Gate when, when I'm stepping on the runway six shot cut down when he for the gunplay pray for my sins in the church on a Sunday yeah. spill a man's beans I'm a drunk chef clothes cut shaving his dome like a monk's head blood say you see spill a man's beans okay you see you see this this spin a man oh spill a man's beans I'm a drunk chef so you know Depending on now, I see why people like I remember in the comments, someone's like, Ayo, long thorn shoehorn got some double entendres, or so they got some things you might miss. So, I've been paying, I've been trying to pay specific attention to this track, I've been trying to listen to it right now. Like, and also, I don't know why, but ever since 2024 came, my hearing has gotten a lot better. Like, I can actively hear stuff these days, but anyway. Spill a man's beans like a drunk chef. Usually, to spill the beans means to let the cat out of the bag. To... <laughs> to...
to bear. Damn it. I thought I could keep it going with with the... Are they called idioms? I think they're called idioms. I was, I, like, I wanted to keep it going. How many idioms can I say that are related to this thing? But usually spilling the, mean, the beans means to tell the secret. But he was saying spill a man's beans like a drunk chef. I like that. Damn, when he for the gunplay, pray for my sins in the church on a Sunday. Spill a man's beans, I'm a drunk chef. Clothes cut, shaving his dome like a monk's head. Bloodshed, taste for the flesh like I'm undead. Sleep best when I'm locked up in a bunk bed. Bloodshed, taste for the flesh like I'm undead. That one's that one that one that one that one's easy to get. I shed taste for the flesh like I'm undead. Sleep best when I'm locked up in a bunk bed. Pop skipping the jump pass. Sleep best when I'm locked up in a bunk bed. Is that a is that a is that is it, because I don't know much about Peter and the bus in terms of uh, personal lives. I assume that that's an indication of when. He used to be in prison. If he ever was in prison, I don't know. Or maybe he just really likes bunk beds. But he said, when I'm locked up in a bunk bed. So he also could... I I am giving this way too much analysis and way too much credit. But he also just could be talking about the fact that he's crazy. <laughs> I don't <really> know. <laughs> Shed taste for the flesh like I'm undead. Sleep best when I'm locked up in a bunk bed. Pop skipping the jump past the pump. Chit chit bow. Let his body slump in the pub garden. Sitting finish begin his top in the morning. The first flight. Oh man, I'm gone and I'm laughing. Smiling, increasing. He's folded and leaking. I've tried to control him. I ought to delete him. Alive in the moon in a dead body. Ah, come on, guy. Come on, guy. Don't. Come on, guy. You could try to sneak it in there, guy. Uh, I tried to control him. I ought to delete him. You try to sneak it past me, you funny guy. Uh, can't sneak it past me. Oh, God. Oh. Hi. <laughs> okay. But I mean, as someone who knows what control of the leak does, it's and I think it just opens a thing where you can choose the task manager. Smiling, increasing, he's folded and leaking. I've tried to control him. I ought to delete him. Alive in the moon, in the dead by the evening. I'm taking him home because the pigs need feeding. Shout out Hannibal Lecter. If you've watched that scene in Hannibal Lecter, I don't know which Hannibal movie it was, but it was one of the Hannibal movies where Hannibal feeds a guy to the pigs. Yeah, I remember that scene vividly in my head because I watched it when I was like 10. It was very scary to me. Only when I took no time for the poop that eat him alive in the moon in the dead by the evening. I'm taking them home because the pigs need feeding. Glad when I walk, make money when I took no time for the poop that lines in the chalk white lines on the board. If you need it, you call me. Free for an hundred, same old story. 450 chopped by the pain slept in the reps and it's 15 grand 15 large for the long form shotgun a sh free for an hundred free for an hundred no time for the pulp that lined in the chalk white lines on the board if you need it you call me free for an hundred same old story 450 chopped by the pain slept in the reps and it's 15 grand 15 large for the long form shotgun a shot from nets and expensive rain Okay, that one was just talking about placing a head on somebody. Smiling, increasing, he's folded and leaking. I've tried to control him. I ought to delete him alive in the moon in the dead body evening. I'm taking them home because the pigs need feeding. Glad when I walk, make money when I talk. No time for the pulp that lines in the chalk white lines on the board. If you need it, you call me. Free for an hundred, same old story. 450 chopped by the pain slept in the reps and it's 15 grand 15 large for the long form shotgun a shot from nets and expensive rain yeah it's just that was that was good that was actually that was i feel like there was some stuff i missed but i'm glad that there was some stuff i caught anyway 
my camera's slowing down a bit, so I'm going to reset it quickly. And I hope <coughs> you enjoyed that. Remember, I forgot to put this at the beginning of the video again. Remember to comment, subscribe, like, or oh, share. And share your thoughts with me. Tell me what you think. Have a good day. I'll see you soon.